Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to talk about the problem that a lot of users have been having when upgrading their Apple devices to iOS 9. This could happen on your iPad or your iPhone, but basically you're downloading the update, you're going to install it, and once it seems like it's installed, you have a screen that says slide to upgrade and you're unable to slide. A number of users have been having this issue. There's a few different ways that you could possibly fix this and I'm going to show you all of those ways in this video. So. The first way is uh, I'm going to be using my iPhone 5 here because I don't want to erase my iPhone 6. Uh, but what I would do at first, if this, if I was at the slide to upgrade screen, I just want to try restarting my phone a few times. So in order to do that, I'm going to hold the sleep wake button, the button up here at the top, and the home button at the same time. Now your sleep wake button might be on the side if you have an iPhone 6 or higher. So I'm going to hold those two buttons at the same time until the phone shuts off. and then I'm going to wait for the Apple logo to appear and then I'm going to let go and that's going to restart my phone and I have heard a few users say that that fixed the issue for them you should be able to slide to upgrade and you're good to go now if that doesn't work here is the next step the next step is to try and restore your iPhone from a backup so you need to connect it to your computer so you can see I've got it connected right here and once it restarts here it's going to show up in my iTunes see the phone's coming up so you can see the phone has now shown up in my iTunes and I just clicked on the phone now hopefully before you started doing this update you backed up your phone if you didn't back up your phone beforehand let's try and back it up now so you'll notice here in iTunes I have this option that says backup now if you have any iTunes updates make sure you run those updates first and then go ahead and click backup now to back your phone up once it finishes backing up, I'm not going to show you that whole process here, you kind of just let it do its thing, you're going to click Restore Backup. You're going to choose the backup that you'd like to restore it from. So you can use the backup that you hopefully created today or yesterday when you started doing the update, whichever backup you'd like to use. And you're going to click Restore. And that is going to bring your phone back to where it was before you started doing the upgrade. You won't have iOS 9 yet you'll still have iOS 8 but all of your data will be there and as soon as Apple fixes this issue you will hopefully be able to update your phone to iOS 9. Now if you cannot do a backup and you don't have a backup and you're still facing this issue unfortunately your only option at this point is to erase your phone completely. It will fix the problem. I've heard that reported from many users. I know it's not the optimal solution, but if you want your phone to work, uh, whether, either, whether you do or don't have your contacts, the option would be to completely erase the phone. So in a second here, my phone's going to come back up in iTunes, and I'll show you where you could do that if you're unable to restore from a backup. So here I am back in iTunes, and if I was unable to do a backup on this phone but I wanted to restore it, I would just click Restore Phone. I would do the update first. I'm using a particular account on my computer that I use for tutorials, and I haven't upgraded to iOS 9 with this iTunes account. I did do it on my iPhone 6, and I didn't have any problems. The video that you're seeing of my phone is actually shot on an iPhone 6, and it's got iOS 9. I had no problems with that. Uh, but if you are having issues this is how you would fix it make sure that you update your iTunes uh, obviously you would have done that already anyways but if you're unable to restore from a backup you're just going to click this restore iPhone button and you're going to be prompted to let you know that hey you're gonna be erasing your entire phone but that's going to hopefully fix the problem for you so I hope you found this video helpful if you did I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more technology tips and tutorials and keep an eye out to hear something more from Apple to see if they can fix this update if you do restore from your backup hopefully in a week or two you will then be able to up upgrade to iOS 9 without any problems that's all I have for you for today this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com